Mō te tau te maunga, hakurangi te awa mā tātua, te waka tauhina re te marae, he uri ahau nō Ngāti Hine, Ngāti Kahungungu ki wairua, rongo mai wahine me mai katoa tainui, ko Tāniko tō kuingua. So kia ora, my name is Tāniko, I whakapapatū or come from and link back to all those hapu that I'm from. I also have Swedish ancestry, um, born and raised in Cambridge in the Māori Waikato. So um, 10 years ago, my sister-in-law, Vena, and I started a business called Soldiers Road Portraits. We had not planned to do a business, it was a organic off the worm kind of fly off the hat idea. We went to a food festival um, and ran a stall and you know Bob's your uncle we haven't been we've been doing our work full-time ever since. Through our work we realized there was a massive um, need for cultural connection because what we do is basically uh, inspired from old portraiture of our ancestors, Māori ancestors and we recreate them of people today. We saw that our, connect, our process was connecting people. We, we thought we were just taking photos, but really there's whakawhanaungatanga, connecting with people, there's kōrero, you're talking about who you are, you're talking about where you're from, you're talking about your aspirations, and so really it's an experience, it's a cultural connection experience, and what we saw was, okay, yeah, we're helping people here. How can we really help? Who would really benefit from our experience? And we landed on prisoners. We figured one, they're the kind of people who need um, to be reminded of their worth. And two, um, they're people that have made mistakes or made bad decisions. And how can we realign their own perception of themselves, their own, you know, a paradigm shift. And when I got there and, and, and was able to connect with these men and realize that for every man that's in prison, there's four kids and a wife and five brothers and, you know, and just this huge huge whānau that miss out on, um, on that connection and, it, and that just it continues the cycle of disconnection. I feel like, it sounds so hard out when I verbalise it but inside it sounds real, um, I feel like I, I was born at this t in this time, in this era, to uplift and empower um, and whakamana our people alongside Pākehā.